Hi everyone, this is Brio Boy 2009 Welcome to part 2 of Brio Boy's review on the Brio Smart Tech Sound Action Tunnel Deluxe Set. Firstly, a little instruction on how exactly to operate the engine. First of all, this button here is the one you need to press down in order to start off the engine. You'll know the engine is started up when its lights flash green and it shouts out joyously, And when the engine goes bye-bye, it lets out a little... But for now, I think I'll turn it on. Turn on, will ya? Oh, perfect. I'm excited too, to be honest. So this part here, this button, is what drives the train forward. And as it does so, it honks its horn. When it stops, it has red lights that flash from the locomotive, and when it goes backwards, it goes... Which is something that I would not approve of for a diesel-electric locomotive, and sounds more like a, a thing you'd find on a garbage truck, to be honest. This red button lets you record your own pre-recorded message. Observe. Choo-choo! And when the engine goes through the orange action tunnel, it will repeat that message. Now then, what do the other action tunnels do? This is the station stop action tunnel. Here's what happens when the train stops at it. This tunnel is also included in the action tunnel. Station, just so you know. Turn on the warning lights. This is the U-turn action tunnel, and it makes the train go in reverse. And it does so until you stop it like that. The thing also works if the train is running in reverse. Albeit, if it's running in reverse into the tunnel, it'll make it go forward. This is the stop action tunnel. Pretty simple. The train simply just stops for a while once the tunnel is activated. And apparently when you press the button, it can play the recorded message again. I just wanted it to go straight here. This is the danger tunnel. When the train passes over it, it breaks down. Until it is finally broken and we have to put it into the train repair station. When it backs into this siding, oops, sorry about that. I did not mean to do that. When it backs into here, It does that. I don't think the engine wants to respond to that. What about this part, Smarty? The engine wash. What? Come on, work for me. Whoops. That was not meant to happen. It's the brake wheel. The wheel that it has on the bottom of it. That's what's, what's preventing it from going. It doesn't want to get fixed for whatever reason. Anyway, if the train is to go to the middle tunnel, that also acts as another message tunnel, as I call them. It didn't want to do it there for whatever reason. I'll just hold it here till the sound stops and see if it wants to say choo-choo again. What in the name of Tweetsie are you doing? Come on, 
do what you're told. Do what Brio programmed you to do. Just, just, just keep going. And there's also this part here. That lifts the loads and then dumps them. Oh, and the train is apparently going backwards again. Anyways, Smarty, I think you've said enough for now. Oh wait, I, I still didn't show the other part of the set. Like most other Brio sets its age, this set also has an elevated mountain section. The train basically has as much power as the big green and mighty red action locomotives. When it goes through the mountain, it shouts out... Just like it does at startup. Then it goes across this quaint little bridge and comes down. That is, of course, if the switches are set correctly. And that's the Brio Smart Tech Sound Action Tunnel Deluxe Set. See you next time on Brio Boy 2009!